I need to talk about one thing that comes up when you start doing a B testing and that is statistical significance. Now, most people don't do a B testing because of this. So what is statistical significance? We need to be able to say confidently that this test we made can be repeated. Okay. So if I do it again, I should get the same results. Otherwise the test is pointless. Okay. So that's what statistical significance tell us. Usually you want to be 90 to 95% sure that if you repeat the test, the test will uh, give the same results. So this thing depends on traffic and conversion rate. These are two different curves and the more these curves are apart, the more you are statistically significant. Okay. This experiment is statistically significant. If they are very close together, you cannot tell the difference between one and another, then A is not better than B and B is not better than A. So your results are inconclusive and this test didn't give you any information, right? So the question is, how do you make uh, sure that your experiment is statistically significant? Let's go to this page here, abtestguide.com. So let's see, suppose that you have 1000 people on the control, 1000 people on the variation and your thing converts. So this is like AA, they are the same, boom. This is what you get. The test result is not significant. It's the same thing basically. So what if this is selling a little bit more? Is selling 60 copies instead of 50 copies then apply changes and you see that the two curves here they are too close so this thing is still not significant you see so to make it significant you have to go higher you see not significant and boom significant so you need 68 conversions to see that b is better than a okay and you see that 68 over 50 is 36 percent higher okay so you you need to do 36 percent better with small traffic if this traffic increases and you have more conversions then it is easier to make it statistically significant so what does it mean? It means that if you have a very small traffic, it's very hard to make A-B testing. This doesn't mean that you shouldn't test. You should focus more, and I will see, into bringing more traffic to the pages with, with still uh, making hypotheses and, and everything like that.